Hi, it's Jen. I'm going to show you the Pilates exercise spine stretch to help you gain some more mobility through your spine. Um, through your, you'll feel it in your hamstrings as well. Um, so really just kind of the whole back line of the body. Um, as we're rounding forward, you'll get a bit of a stretch, but it's also about working with control and um, making sure that you are in good alignment and that nothing is being overstretched. So I'm gonna sit flat on the mat here. If, if this right away is too much, if you don't have the hamstring length, meaning you end up sitting like this, rounded, can't sit comfortably with your rib cage right over your hips then go ahead and put a towel um, I could also just kind of fold up and curl up this mat underneath me like this um, see if that gives a little bit of a lift you'll have to experiment for your body and see how much of a lift you need um, if that is troublesome to, to be sitting here. But you wanna be able to keep your pelvis neutral and have that little tiny bit of um, curve in your low back um, and still be able to keep your legs out straight because from here, we're going to round forward. So I'm gonna put my arms out here. I'm gonna exhale and nod my chin towards my chest. Starting from my neck, I'm rounding down and then my hands start to reach out. I'm not moving through my pelvis. I'm still rounding down through my upper spine, rounding over, reaching long with the arms, and then rounding through my lower back. And then as I get to the end of my range, I don't want to stretch too far. I'm going to take a breath in, and then exhale and start to reverse that. So I'm rounding or I'm straightening back up from my low back, stacking my body back up, coming back up, stacking my ribs right over my hips, lifting my chin back up and coming back to start. I'll do it one more time. Exhale, nodding my chin down. Starting to round down through my upper back, through my ribs, rounding through my belly more, reaching long through the arms, and then inhaling, exhaling again, and coming back up through the spine, rolling my spine all the way back up. And ideally do that three to five times and you'll feel the mobility, but really focus on the quality of the movement and feeling each vertebrae. You want to just have that sensation as you're going forward of, of each vertebrae opening more and more and then keep that open feeling as you come back up and feel yourself be taller. So just a great way to start to mobilize your spine, get a little more hamstring length as you're just sitting here on the floor like this with your legs out in front. Um, so there you have it. Thanks for watching. Bye.